start starter. Looking good. Get a starter stand. 10 cars, six laps, top five to six or mania here at the end of the night. Logan Schnacki and Steve Chero on the front row. Two by two, in turn four. Green flag and we're racing. Six or mania. Who's gonna go with the top five? Bingham on the bottom in the six car, turns it like a doorknob. Here comes the 45, three wide. Bobby Carter splits the difference, sends it in the three. Carter and Bingham go at it for third. Chero and Price for fifth. Chero getting swallowed up like a bologna sandwich. Your leader, Logan Schnacki in a 176. Here's the Holcomb Hustler in the fifth, Mike Peterson in the 172 car. Top five settled in a little bit, but here comes the Holcomb Hustler. Looking for fourth to the inside of Bobby Carter in the 45. Bingham closing up on the lead duo. Top five have separated themselves a little bit. Battle is for fourth. Getting through Sixer Heat Race 3. Schnacki with the lead. Bush in second, Bingham in third. Two to go, side by side at a four. Peterson in the fourth. Battle knock, Carter kinda sorta back to fifth, but not yet. Now, Holcomb Hustler in the fourth. Should be one to go. One to go for Logan Schnacki. They are abusing some tires, aren't they? Hey, everybody in the top five looking good. Checkered flag for Logan Schnacki. He'll win heat number three for the Sixers. Bobby Carter's going to Sixer Mania in fifth spot of the 45. Fourth spot to the 172, the Holcomb Hustler, Mike Peterson. Third spot to the six, to Jeremy Bigham. Runner up to the 12, a Tyler Bush. And your winner of the third heat for the James Cafe Sixers, the 176 car from Huntley, Illinois. How about it for Logan Schnacki? Logan Schnacki in a G6. I had a G6 one time. It was my least favorite car I ever owned. In case you wondered, it gets around a quarter mile pretty good though.